Quests at launch were akin to found world quests. They were largely received through holotape recordings, terminals and notes. Robots were also utilized to deliver the story of the quest and other traditional roles played by NPCs in past iterations. There are robots and other creatures with personalities also engaged in bartering. At launch, almost all other living characters met by a player were those of other players at release. The Wastelanders update introduced living characters who now give quests. Quests in Fallout 76 are quite varied. While the game has its share of fetch quests, there are also quests such as photography-based missions requiring players to take photographs using an in-game camera. Fallout 76 also has a few obstacle courses requiring players to run through an area under a time limit. Due to the multiplayer format, many quests are instanced. For players to assist each other in an instanced mission, they require the team leader to enter a location first. Other members of the team can assist the team leader in their instance, although they will not have progress done on their own character. Members can listen to the team leader's dialogue with NPCs as well. Due to the online shared nature of the world, with the exception of a few moments during quests, or some wandering NPCs outdoors, NPCs cannot be killed or harmed by the player. They cannot be pickpocketed and they do not react to the player looting items in their vicinity. Nuking an area with NPCs will result in them wearing hazmat suits.